Hello everyone, I am Dr. Pradeep from India. I will be talking about DHT that is direct hair transplant. Direct hair transplant is not a new technique altogether. This is a modification of the existing FUE which was published in 2002 and this paper of ours we published in 2013 which we call as a modification of the FUE. So the FUE the first step is extraction of the grafts and of course the second step is making the sites and third step is placing the grafts. In DST we have reversed everything. So the first step in DST is making the sites and the second and third together is simultaneous extraction and placement of the grafts together. So this reverse of the steps has ensured that the grafts stay outside the body for least time out, outside the body. So this is the summarization and when the grafts are least out of the body then they are least exposed to mechanical handling, trauma, you know, desiccation and infection. So here uh, let us elaborate the first step is making the sites that is the density the depth the direction of the slits have been determined by this step of course we know the total number of grafts required in the whole procedure. So here I, I feel like this is the most crucial step where the surgery is being controlled the fate of the procedure is controlled by the main doctor after that the two steps that is extraction of the grafts and placement of the grafts are very very important but the degree of importance of those two steps are a little bit lesser than the first step that is you know you know uh, describing uh, the fate of the procedure by making the slits and of course controlling everything So here uh, the step 2 that is extraction and step 3 that is placement happening together from all the directions whether patient is lying down on the on a, on a stomach or from left lateral right lateral the scoring extraction and placement we try to do simultaneously if the patient is not comfortable on the prone position then we make the patient sit on the on a stool and we have designed uh, you know those kind of ergometry so that uh, we can do from all the angles without compromising the speed of course the patient should not be having the discomfort on the left lateral position uh, and of course all the position as i said so what we do we delegate we can delegate these steps of like you know uh, placement of the grafts but the people who place the graft they don't decide the fate just go and unload it and also the extraction step is also sometimes uh, I do uh, of course to uh, you know other doctors to do that so that the workload is distributed uh, amongst people and that is the greatest advantage that I felt after introducing uh, DST so the workload uh, is not much upon my body uh, at the same time I control whole surgery and supervise each and every step so this the extraction part and unloading is also done uh, you know can be done by other people so here you can see we are using implanters and these implanters are done little implanters they have been loaded and they do unloading into the pre-med sites which has already been made by the primary doctor the so and of course here the chances of making a new track or new design is least by the placing team so here you can see all the things happening together scoring extraction uh, loading in the implant or unloading everything happening together this is the main thing of direct hair transplantation that is DHT our speed is up to like 3000 odd grafts can be extracted and placed uh, within uh, 8 hours and of course we have worked to this speed over last like 6-7 years and uh, yes you can see here all the steps happening together 
when you see uh, everything happen in our facility in at a time up to six to eight people are required at a time in the, the procedure room this is very very important know that uh, multiple people will be requiring so ensuring a maximum uh, maximization of the growth happens by least out of the body time least mechanical handling and of course practicing it like with efficiency uh, over multiple over many years thank you so much